Hi guys, thank you so much for stopping by. Um, I wanted to bring to you another some other items that I did purchase, but I wanted to show you an alternative to using either using some um, dotting tools. If you don't, if you are the person that wants to have dotting tools and not use like a pen or uh, an orange wood stick or toothpick you can purchase dotting tools and sometimes dotting tools can be very expensive depending on where you get them from or they can be inexpensive and then you have to wait for them to be shipped well I found an alternative at my local craft store I know y'all say I stay in that craft store which I do um, between Hobby Lobby Michael and Joann's yeah I stay in my craft stores but I just stumbled on these one day as of course I had a coupon and I wanted to use my coupon but then I stumbled on an item that I did not know existed because I don't do it but I said oh my gosh these look like dotting tools these are the ones that I originally purchased and you know they're dual ended one end has a bigger dotting end let me kind of angle that and then the other of course has the smaller smaller end and these are these are all of those across the board just like that one end is bigger and the other is smaller but this is the packaging that it came in let me zoom out a little bit and this is for let me see this is the soft grip three pack embossing and styling set and it includes the small stylus tool, medium stylus tool, and the embosser. So this is intended for, if you can see that, for doing stenciling um, or doing embossing work. So um, that's what that originally was intended for. But for me, it will be used for nail art. So I bought one pack, and I just wanted to leave that in the packaging and just show you the actual tools and I'm, I've taken the other pack out that I have. I bought two. You know me. Okay. And I just thought these were awesome. And these have these are, these are also dual ended and they have the grips on them which is great for people who you know have a hard time holding them or if, uh, you, you're you have arthritic hands this is awesome so they have the smaller end and then they have her have a fat, fatter end you know on some of them so I thought this was awesome great I have used it to do drag marbling because this one is ultra fine at the tip. Now I did have an issue with this prong being, you know, loose. So I had to glue it back. You might see a little glue around it, but that's fine for the price. And I pretty much got them free with my coupon um, at Joanne, but that's no issue. I just took a glue stick and glued it back. But um, I thought this was great. And you can probably use this for water marbling same thing same difference so and like I said this is I love the fact that it has the little grips on them as opposed to the regular you know dotting tool it's just a bit more comfortable it really is especially if you're trying to do detail work and a lot of detail work that gets kind of you know tiresome and then sometimes you know if you hold your pen or pencils pretty tight like I do sometimes um, that can be a strain on your finger and kind of hurts but I thought this was just a great buy so you guys let me know what you think um, have you found some alternatives you know of using uh, uh, or found something that's similar to a dotting tool but is not intended for a dotting tool get in the comments and let me know what you've done or what you have in your arsenal I want to thank y'all for stopping by once again and I'll see you in the next one Y'all be blessed. Bye.